what is your favorite um, Taekwondo move, by the way? Well, now it's getting up out of a chair. <laughs> after, <laughs> after years of abusing my joints. Like, run, chop the table. Or, oh, you know, gosh. Like, what is this pseudo, then? yuck, pseudo. <laughs> Do you remember? I'm sure you remember. Uh, that yeah, no, ago. it's in, and I try to throw at least 100 kicks a week just to kind of oh, stay cool. street. Do you? Yeah, Do you just really? to kind of stay, wow. stay street savvy. Wow. Uh, you know, my, my boy was going, my oldest boy, yeah. uh, Zeb, was going to school up in Pennsylvania for a few years uh -huh. and um, nice little woodsy school you know Mark Ruffalo's kid went there it's like it's like a wonderful private school that I could afford because okay. it was far enough away from New York yeah. but it was you know it was nature walks and yeah. it was just he's a really gentle kid and and then um, I was just missing him uh, it was the drive was too much for me so I, I when I moved to New York and stayed in New York because the work schedule, I was missing too much. Mm -hmm. So my ex-wife and then they moved here. Yeah. So now I get to see him almost every day and yeah, we split that. time 50-50. Okay. But he went from that school to New York Public School. Okay. Interesting. And so he had like six, yeah. seven. Mm -hmm. And I noticed after a couple of weeks his shoulders starting to drop. Oh, so really? start to drop. I'd be like, everything wow. feels good. It's like, yeah, yeah. But I noticed this change in confidence. I noticed this change in wow. body language. So I said to him, What's going on? He's like, Thomas is just this kid. Thomas, who's mm -hmm. huge for his his age. Oh, I see. Yeah. Like, his dad's like six eight, two hundred eighty. Oh my goodness. So the kid so is big. big boy. He's got a lot of anger. This kid. Mm -hmm. So he was picking on my son at mm -hmm. recess. Oh, bully. Oh, but my son like wanted to be friends with him, so it was yeah. one of those weird things where like. Yeah. Yeah. Like he's trying nice to as buddy as up with his tormentor. So that's where he probably gets so, uh, And so it got so bad that Thomas was like choking him out on the playground. Like choking him out. Oh. Yeah, like six or seven. Oh. So I was like, Zip. Go. You gotta teach him something. Yeah. Uh -huh. Here's a couple things. That's right. Never, never strike. Mm -hmm. Never punch. Never kick. Just a couple little things. I see. I said in Taekwondo we call that reaching and understanding. Mm -hmm. That this is not something you can do. Yes. So as you tell him no, mm -hmm. that that doesn't stop, you then reach an understanding with him. Mm -hmm. So you do this, you do that, you do that. Yes. But I said never hit, never punch. Mm -hmm. Okay. Protect himself with the pressure points, like, right? Yeah. Yes. So mm -hmm. you know, stiff finger into the into the uh, solar plexus. Yes. And I was like, just press. You don't, you don't strike. Mm. Just keep pressing and tell them stop. Yes. Or stop. So it work. Here, here, any of this stuff. You can press here if you want. Yeah. He goes, I don't know, Papa. I was like, just give it a try. Uh -huh. he comes home like a week later, he goes, Papa, that stuff's amazing. <laughs> no Because Thomas kept coming up to me, pushing me, and I just went, I need you to stop now. And, um, because the fingers yeah right are, into his center right into I mean I've watched my grandmaster w would take a pig a live pig what? through the pig yeah. out the pig wow pig. so the fingers are immensely yeah. powerful and I watch guys do uh, break cement blocks with their, just their fingers yes so it's about speed it's not speed creates the power yeah so I was like just and he's like he'd come in towards me and, and and I just kept you have to stop now you have to stop and he goes he kept walking and I kept pressing and then he broke down and he's like that hurts and he broke down crying and ran away and he goes he's left me alone for like two weeks now wow that's great that's didn't you cool. feel proud Yes. Because you were not the father that goes on the school bus renting and raving, oh, ready yeah, to be yeah. arrested, you no. handled it so and well. Now, and now yeah. my daughter, who's seven, takes karate on Friday afternoons. Oh, and really? like, you don't have to like it. <laughs> yeah. You can hate me for making you take it. Yeah. But you will take it for three or four years, and you can yell at me all yeah. you want. Yeah. But you will never have to worry about feeling unsafe as a woman. Yeah, that's right. And in college, it's on a date, at the ATM. The that's great. That's great, yeah. That's <laughs> really good. But what if I don't want to? I was like, you just have to go once a week mm -hmm. for like five years, four years, three years. Wow. Yeah. That I never have to worry about. You. Yes. It does it even good discipline. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now the Well, weight? the shoulders came back. Yeah. yeah. The head oh, went the back up. Yeah, confidence, everything. The, yeah. Body wow. the body never lies. No. That language. Is the baby going to be doing this? Yes, he's Maybe he's only nine months, by yeah, the way. Yeah, he's nine months old. He's already started. <laughs> right, right? But, but you, you've got you to will suck it up. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's called a wet diaper. Oh, my goodness. No, you you changed the diaper.